In last video, we discussed about the 8000 Vedic Astrological Horoscope, all the significations and what it stands for in your life. In this video, we are going to talk about the 9000, all you need to know about the 9000 coming up. Namaste and welcome to Pramanic Astrology channel. I'm your host Prasad Mahazani, help you go further faster into Vedic Astrological Studies. In this video, we are going to discuss about the ninth house, the significations of the ninth house and why and what it stands for in your life. If you are new to my channel, please consider subscribing. You will be getting Vedic Astrological videos just like this one. And if you want to know uh, your planetary placements, please go and check out my website and get your uh, Vedic Astrological report. Okay. So today we are going to talk about the ninth house. Ninth house is the Bhagya Sthana. Bhagya literally means fortune and Sthana means house. So Bhagya Sthana is your house of fortune. Ninth house is the house of travel. This is a long distance travel. Th third house is also travel. Twelfth house is also travel. But ninth house is a long, long distance travel. Ninth house is fifth from the fifth, so it shows the higher studies and PhD, master's degree, all these can be seen from the ninth house. Okay. Ninth house is third from the seventh house, so the siblings of your spouse can also be seen from the ninth house. Ninth house is second to the eighth house, eighth house is your mm, misfortune. So ninth house is your fortune. Eighth house is about your in-laws. So ninth house is a dhanasthana for your in-laws. So ninth house gives strength to the eighth house significations. Okay. Uh, the, the ninth house is a cadent house along with three, six and twelve house. Okay. Ninth house, the significator for the ninth house is Jupiter because in natural zodiac, it is ruled by the Sagittarius sign. So ninth house also corresponds to the Sagittarius sign, which is ruled by the mm, Jupiter. Ninth house is about the higher purpose, the wisdom, the spiritual practices you follow, the religious ideologies you have, and your higher beliefs are seen from the ninth house. Ninth house is 12th to the 10th house. So it is a house of loss for the 10th house. It is a house of Bhagya. Okay. Ninth house is 11th from the 11th. So it is Labhasthan of the Labhasthan. That is house of gains for the house of gains. 11th house is a house of gain. And ninth is 11th from the 11th. So it is the ultimate house of gain. That is why it is the house of gain and house of Bhagya. Your gains can also be seen from this placement, or from this house. Ninth house, the Sagittarius is the last fire sign. Ninth house is the last house in the Dharmatrikon houses as well as in the fire element prime. Fire element prime is 159 houses and the Dharma code is 159. So this is the ninth one. We have covered one fifth. Now we are into the ninth and the final house in the fire element as well as in the Dharma code houses. This is about your higher beliefs and eighth house is a house of death. Why there are so many houses after eighth house, ninth, tenth, eleventh, twelfth? because there is a life beyond the death and ninth house is the first house after the death it is the higher beliefs the spirituality in your life the life beyond the death the things which you don't know but they exist beyond this material world ninth house is also about your ethics the righteousness the divine law all these can be signified from the ninth house. Ninth house is seventh from the third house. 
so the spouse of your siblings can also be seen from the ninth house ninth house is one of the the most important trinal house ninth house is also the sixth from the fourth house so the obstacles and diseases of the mother can also be seen from the ninth house let's summarize what is ninth house ninth house is the house of bhagya and it is the house of labha it is the house of higher education ethics righteousness spiritual laws religious ideologies and uh, higher education long distance travel all these all these things can be seen from the ninth house in your horoscope now the lord of the ninth house the planet sitting in the ninth house the planet aspecting the ninth house will change the uh, magnitude and the element of the ninth house and the flavor of the ninth house whether it will be good bad or the best okay this was ninth house as much as i could hold grasp and share with you guys if you are new to my channel please consider subscribing you will be getting vedic astrological videos just like this one Otherwise, we will see you in the next video. Hit that like button and, and, and we will see you in the next video. Love and peace.